Okay, welcome back. This is a mystery tackle box that I bought from a pawn shop and I uh, just kind of rummaged around through it a little bit and the guy told me 10 bucks I can have it. So I paid 10 bucks for it. It's an old ancient Plano tackle box. So let's see what's inside. Very nice. Oh, it's got the, uh, the metal hinges on it. That's, that's an older one, because nowadays they have the plastic hinges. Okay, let's start with the mysterious bottles. Now this uh, says Grizzly Clip Clamp-Ons, uh, size zero, 10 pieces. Now this is what those split shots used to come in. It's kind of sketchy, but shop sinkers, different sinkers and stuff like that. Now these are a different kind of sinker. Not sure what kind they are. Looks like they're just line sinkers. You just clip them onto your line. Very weird looking. They are made of lid. Doesn't look like it's been used. A stringer. Bunch of Snap swivels, a bunch of hooks in here, trebles, a bunch of swivels, quite a few of these guys right here. This looks like there's about 10 of them, maybe 20 of them in there. Quite a few of the uh, bell sinkers, uh, two ounce, one ounce. Let's get up top here. Uh, an old fashioned one. Of those line, you know, clamp on sinkers. We have this. These guys here usually for trout. Little kit. Looks like it hadn't been used, but just one thing missing out of it. And that looks like it. Looks like everything there is still intact. Nice. Very nice for trout. Hook included. Some extra fishing line. Still good. It's not dry rod. Zebco scale. With measuring tape. More sinkers. Snailed fish hooks, some more snail fish hooks, some more snail fish hooks, more of them, quite a few more of them, empty bag, a bobber, another bo two other bobbers, a whole bunch more sinkers in the bottom of this, another um, bobber here for fishing. Some more line. An old baby food jar. This is a top to an open face reel. Looks like it's a Abu Garcia. Yep. This, is, this says France, made in France, so it's an Abu Garcia and a Mitchell case. I don't know if that guy who had this before me or woman was planning to use that for a pole, but I'm gonna use, I have one in mind. More snails hooks, more sinkers. Of a sinker. That's a seven ounce. That's a very unusual. Some bass worms. A lot of sinkers. Rigs. And a 
whole bunch of other stuff in here. A bunch of sinkers. So overall, uh, that's real oil. I don't think there's anything in there. Some more sinkers, as you guessed. And um, a lot of split shots. A bunch of split shots. Hooks. A whole lot of hooks in here. Swivels, snap swivels. More of these nice looking sinkers. More of these sinkers. Alright. But that's what's in here. Um, there's well over $20 worth of items in here. I know that. Um, overall, together. Uh, I know for those of you who do not fish, you probably just, you probably will say, like, what is this stuff? You know. But if you know what it is, you know that the value of this stuff is worth way more than the ten dollars it's been on the tackle box too. So I do know that we got a really good deal. And this stuff is it's not like heavily used. It looks like somebody was like hard up for money, or is that how they say it? Mm -hmm. And they just pawned their tackle or they stole it or something, but it doesn't matter. Right now, it's mine. Legally. Uh -huh. <laughs> and we're going to put it to good use. And we're going to put it to good use. There is a lot of good stuff in this tackle box. Um, those hooks, I really don't want to dig through them, but there's some really nice circle hooks in there, um, some barbs, looks like a trout hooks. Yeah, nice, more trout hooks. Um, a whole bunch of snap swivels. I wish, I kind of wish I didn't buy all those snap swivels I bought, because there's so many in here. <laughs> like a whole pile of them, even the small ones. I mean, there's a lot of good stuff in there. It, I mean, if, like I said, if you are a fisherman, you'll know that there's a lot of good stuff in here. Um, just like any other fisherman, I am picky. But at this point, not very picky. <laughs> Looks like there was a good haul on that one. It's a good deal. To be honest, I don't think that guy uh, cared what was in the box. He just wanted to sell it. So, ten dollars. It's an old tackle box, it's full of good tackle. Thank you for stopping by. Don't forget to leave a like, share, and if you're not already, subscribe. And uh, keep a lookout on 